List of Goa Shias. May 6, 1937. The Hindenburg sails serenely over New York. An iconic vehicle of her time, she's just hours away from her demise, when she'll catch fire and crash to the ground in Lakehurst, New Jersey. The disaster will take the lives of 36 people and leave an indelible mark on the history of aviation. While you might already be familiar with the basic details of the Hindenburg disaster, these five lesser-known facts about the incident just might surprise you. 1. Her predecessor logged a million injury-free miles. The Hindenburg had logged only 62 flights before she met her demise, and these were demo flights. She was attempting to complete her very first commercial flight when she caught fire. But her predecessor, the Graf Zeppelin, made 509 flights in all, amounting to over a million miles without a single injury. She visited North America, South America, Asia, the Middle East, and the Arctic as well. She still relied on hydrogen for lift, but somehow avoided the Hindenburg's fate. Her success makes the development of the Hindenburg seem more rational, less rash. 2. No camera caught the actual moment of ignition, this in spite of the large crowd on hand. Still photographers managed to freeze time closer to that fateful moment, showing that spark must have met hydrogen in the rear of the ship, as gas cells there clearly ignited first. Newsreel cameras caught the incident even later in time, and editors had to resort to jump cuts between her flying serenely many moments before and the terrible conflagration. Three, newsreel footage shows a crewman jumping from an extreme height, this looks like falling debris, but, sadly, is likely elevator man Ernst Hutchell, who probably opted to jump, in spite of his great height, rather than be consumed by the wall of fire that raced up the ship's axial corridor. This photo, shows what Hutchell was up against, as a geyser of fire erupts from the axial corridor's bow exit. 4. Your odds of survival on the Hindenburg were way better than on the Titanic, the cataclysm captured on film looks impossible to survive, but, in fact, you had roughly a 2 in 3 chance of surviving the Hindenburg. Many sustained terrible injuries from falls and burns, Still, a significant majority managed to jump from the Hindenburg when she was close to the ground and flee to safety. You had only a 1 in 3 chance of surviving the Titanic, and your odds were even worse than that if you weren't a first-class passenger. The Titanic was also magnitude's deadlier overall, killing thousands of people whereas the Hindenburg killed tens of people. 5. She really was fast for her day. The Hindenburg was significantly faster than the steamships, such as the famous Queen Mary, that were commonly used for transatlantic travel at the time. The Hindenburg's top speed was around 84 miles per hour, 135 kilometers per hour, while the fastest steamships could only manage around 30 to 35 miles per hour, 48 to 56 kilometers per hour. This speed advantage meant that the Hindenburg could cross the Atlantic in about two and a half days, weather permitting, compared to the four to five days it took steamships to make the same journey. And, just for you, a special bonus fact. 6. There was talk of calling her, the Hitler, that was propaganda minister Goebbels' idea anyway. Funny thing was of that Hitler never much liked the airships, comparing them to a new flooring that seems revolutionary, but is actually apt to explode if walked on with the wrong shoes. He said to have said, no, I shall never get into an airship. And there you have it, 6 facts about, the Hindenburg. Hopefully, you learned something new about this remarkable and tragic event. If you want more content like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button, give us a like, or drop a comment. Thanks for watching.